Hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Fire Emblem, uh, Fates, uh, Conquest. So, uh, yeah, we just have to, now we're doing the Sevenfold Sanctuary chapter. So, I actually have devised a strategy for this, because, uh, this chapter is pretty hard. Like, very hard if you don't know how to tackle it. So. Yeah. So, this chapter, so, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have, uh, basically Effie just tank these, all, like, all these guys, because she has enough defense to the oh wait that's oh uh yeah 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 uh-huh <laughs> what so she has enough defense yeah go on i, I fucking meant, hope so i meant to put effie in front but accidentally god it's... damn i hope they have enough defense for that <laughs> don't worry i mean silas can do it but the thing is though that effie can reliably do it so i don't want silas to do it because he's gonna fucking die <laughs> yeah like even if he does like these guys have counter so. actually i think he might be fine like he's fighting like what two archers at that time uh he's fighting uh yeah but still i just want him to be like on full health just in case oh fair so for this side, the mage um, works, me. Oh yeah. So for this side, I have a um, Mozu who's gonna basically first start off with uh, taking on these uh, fighters. Now they don't do, they don't kill her, luckily. Mm -hmm. I was originally going to have her like take on these two, but the thing is, apparently, um, uh, Rinka moves actually on Lunatic. Yeah, I'd be surprised. So, I'd be surprised if she didn't. Well, I. Didn't. I feel like that would take out a lot of the difficulty. Yeah, well, all these guys. Yeah, well, on hard, I don't think Met Setsuna or the other mini bosses move, but on Lunatic they do. Which really? I didn't, yeah, I didn't. Yeah. I feel like they should just be moving, anyways. No, I think on the other difficulties they don't move. I think. Don't call me on that though. I I believe you, but I'm just saying, like, I I feel like that's just something that should happen. I'm just I'm surprised it didn't. Mm -hmm. So on. So now that Mosu has basically got the fuck buffed up out of her, and basically she's mm -hmm. doing plus four damage and taking minus four damage, I think either yeah, these yeah. guys will attack her or they're just gonna move and not do anything. I hope they I attack her. I think they're gonna move and not do anything. Please attack her. Unless they do some okay. damage. No, they're doing damage. And she does just enough damage to kill them. Ow. Damn. Oh, nice crit. Okay. Oh, cool. I think this is the first Mosu crit we've gotten. No, I think we got one in the last chapter. So this is like the Did second you? one. I think so. And yeah, oh, now right. Paragon's back into effect where she's getting a ton of experience now. Oh, great. Well, Paragon's always in effect, no matter what. It's I know, just... but still, she just was getting like four points of experience last chapter. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, I forgot how cool that animation is. Mm -hmm. And I think... Oh, my God. Damn, okay. Oh. Hello. All right, well, show gauge. Thank you, Nyx. Oh. God damn! I just love the duplication effect. Like it's, a, it's it is like, pretty. It's yeah. like something out of Samurai Jack. Yeah. Oh my god! Nice, Mozu. And okay, this yeah, this guy has still speed, unfortunately. Ow. Oof. And here come the arch. Okay, so these guys. So let's see, how does Effie do? Okay, she only takes two damage, so... And if she's on this, uh, on the staircase, actually, she'll only take, um, she'll only take, um, she'll take no damage, actually. Alright. Oh, well, let's nice. just, If she kills, she can <laughs> kill, kill this guy. Please, Effie. Thank you, okay. Cool. Yeah, honestly, okay. now, okay, so basically the rest of these archers are just, are just basically, like, mince me, because she takes two damage from them. Actually, yeah. she only takes some two damage from the from these steel Yumi guys. These iron Yumi guys do no damage to her. Oh, nice. So now I can base, and I'm gonna try and give Nyx a lot of experience here because I want her to at least get one level up so that way she can use them on Nasra too. Yeah, I do feel like these like first rooms are kind of like the the difficulty check, and like if you can make it through them, you can kind of make it through the rest of them without like too much issue. It's just like it's front loaded, you know. Yeah. Though the the um, uh, Kaze one and the Azama one are kind of like puzzles for me, a little bit. I can I can see that. I am Rika, proud daughter of the Flame Tribe's chief. I will not allow you to capture the Rainbow Sage. Didn't you already capture the Rainbow Sage? Yeah, they already. Well, they already took like, that's, him captive. Well, that's like then you're capturing him. Bro. Yeah. I guess we're capturing him back, like fucking. Why didn't you kill me? Perhaps you were wrong about Nor. No, it can't be. This is the way of peace. This way of peace must be Alex's path. 
All right, and just like that um. is enough experience for Nick's magic skill res, okay? And actually, has shot I mean, you. it's something. I hey, think, nice. I think we'll we get, get dark magic. Heart, heart seeker. I think that's fair. Yeah. So now with Shadow Gift, she can now use the Nosferatu Tome, which is basically the only reason why you should ever have Shadow Gift, because true. There's no yeah. other dark magic in this game. <laughs> yeah, like, are there actually no other dark magic tomes? Because yeah, I I've remember there being I've Nosferatu, checked, but like, I've I don't think there's enough. Forest, and I've checked the Good Fire on the wiki. This is the only dark magic in all fates. <laughs> I love that we need to specify the good fire on wiki. What, you really but think we're going to check that other wiki? You're insane. It'd be you funny. So. It would be it'd funny. It would be pretty but you'd funny. Be insane. I'm not going to lie. I would be insane. That's true, but it'd be funny. Okay, so I think. Wait. Damn. Oh, yeah, I just said it's a... Actually, what the fuck? What? I'm just. I'm, I'm still reeling from that. <laughs> yeah, like, this is. Like, in. um, At least in, like, Awakening, like, di Dark Magic wasn't that. Oh, okay, nice. Well, they uh, were still, like three or four like dark magic oh, well, yeah, because yeah. you had like ruined you had flux you had um Nosferatu. you Nosferatu, had um, yeah Fenrir, i think you did have Fenrir. that's okay. true that was the era and then you had um, um, waste which, right. you had waste which, which was the brave tome yes that was nice yeah so i, I mean i did something else to do i think there was an s rank tome i'm not positive <laughs> no there were no s rank weapons in uh awakening <laughs> Would they just A rank weapons? Yeah, you, yeah. Oh, wait, A rank? Yeah, that was your max rank in Awakening. You can oh, only go up to A rank. That's. Dude, I'm fucking. I haven't played Awakening so long. <laughs> but, oh, yeah, in that case, then that was Fenrir. Because I remember there was, like, the Hell Swath, the fucking. Oh, uh... that's an axe. <laughs> well, I know, but I'm talking about the other, like, max rank weapons oh, okay. that you got from, like, that, like, the fucking. Remember, like, the 12 Dead Lords and shit? Oh, that yeah. That were, like, it oh. there that yeah. had them? I'm not talking about the fucking Thracia ones. I'm talking about the Awakening ones. Like, yeah, yeah, I know. What you're I think it was about. the chapter. That was the Aversa chapter, right? Yes, that was the, that was the first yeah. Aversa chapter. Yeah, that's true. Not the one where you recruited. Mm -hmm. But that one was neat as well. Yeah, because wasn't that like the mirror one where yeah, you had where like you had to, yeah, like <laughs> yeah, that was neat. That I, was I like I like I love that. That was one of my favorite like um um um, um extra like parallax you can get. You, you, had to cool. you had to face yourself. Like how? Like yeah. not a lot of Fire Emblem games do that. I think that's the only. That's, no, I think that's the only official one that's ever done that, though. I think so. Yeah. Like yeah, official. I I think so. I do think like there is a um. Uh, I think there might have been a hack that did something similar to that. Uh yeah, there probably was. I, I know don't Dark remember. D I know Dark Deity did do, do that though. Yeah, and that was cool. Yeah. Well, Dark Deity is obviously like the best RPG we've ever played, right? Oh, totally. Yeah, I'm so looking forward to playing the sequel. Dude, I'm I'm actually super hyped. <laughs> um, I'm so fucking excited. I hope they keep the writing like one to one. Oh my god, and it's have just you, like, like it is you, just have, as good as it was then. Have you tuned to some of the streams though? For Dark Deity too? Yeah. No, I have not. Is oh my good? god, dude, Adol's in there. What? Adol, you know the mage. Like, for real? Yeah, he's grown up. <laughs> nice. Wait, hold on. That's so fucking funny. Oh my god. Huh. All right. All right, and nice. Okay, there we go. So like, you're kind of good for this. Like I don't, I don't even gotta do anything here. I could fucking be browsing Twitter and this should be fun. You're on Alex. Yes, I am Setsuna. I'm Lady Hinoka's retainer. Nice to meet you. Polite even to the enemy. I expect nothing less from Hinoka's guardian. Oh, are you the enemy? Even though you're her brother, huh? Um, yes. I mean, it's complicated. Did you really not know that? Hmm. No. Maybe. It doesn't really matter. I guess it's time for you to die now. Ah, oh, shucks. Wait, oh fuck, I should've used your lance, damn it. Just, oh no, not Satsuna. I lost. Oh well, guess I'll retreat for now. Oh my god, why is my- I should have my soundboard open for this. This is like the perfect time for it. I can't breathe. I can't fall here. I, I must, must make my retreat. <laughs> damn yeah. it. It's alright. Oh. I am the soundboard. <laughs> So yeah, this room is very scary because of uh, Azama's Hexing Rod. His hit rate is actually pretty good with that Hexing Rod, no matter how high your res is, though. 
Maybe True. Mozu can take it? Like, maybe? <laughs> maybe? Well, I think that her stuff is mainly about reducing magic damage, about actually reducing, like, the amount of res. No, she does I, have decent res. No, right? she ha yeah, that's the thing. She has decent res, though, so maybe she can avoid a hits from the Hexing Rod? Shit, maybe? The problem is that you have to get in, like, the, his range is, like, this entire, like, area right here. Like, so I no matter, fucking know. So no matter where you go in the enemy range, you're going to be in Azama's range, too. Like, he's placed so perfectly, which I hate. Well, I think that's part of, like, the, like, hey... No, I understand that, that like, good map meant, design. it's meant to be difficult, but still, like, that doesn't stop you from hating it. Yeah. So, I did check Epi, by the way, and the thing is that she can actually, um, kill this guy with the Dual Naginata. Really? Yeah. Although, oh, honestly, you don't need to because these ninjas can't reach you on the first turn, so Silas could theoretically kill this guy with the Lazlo plate. Mm. So I'm just going to do that. Because yeah. I want him to at least get some experience, because he's about to hit level 13. Hmm. Alright, so... Yeah, fair enough. Um, let's see how Mozu does against these guys. Okay, uh, I don't even think they're going to move, actually. Um... Eh, maybe... Let's see. I don't think so. So let's see, what's this hit rate against Mozu? 40%? Uh... Uh, okay, nice, she dodged. Hey, it's a miss. Let's go. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> Kill yeah. that motherfucker. Oh, nice. Okay, nice job. Nice. Silas, all right. I think there's a level up. Good job, Silas. Uh, uh, close. close. One more, dude. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, that causes the rest of these guys to move. That's perfect, actually. That, yeah, that actually does kind of work. Because then I can move. I think I'm Did Azama out. move at all? Uh, no, and he doesn't move. More so, no, he's can he? Oh, he? Oh, he's stationary? Oh, okay. Yeah. And now... I was going to say, like, can he? And now I can, and Epi has now, just enough strength to kill these guys. Nice. And the thing is, though, that she even though they do damage zero damage, Kaze? they still attack her. I was gonna say, do they like do damage to Kaze, or fucking does she like take damage from Kaze? Also, is do they no. have poison strike? Or? No, they do not have poison strike. They just have lunge. Then why the fuck are they still attacking? Uh, the debuff her basically, and even after the debuff, they still it do doesn't no stack. To... No, no, I know, and they still do no damage to her even after the debuff. But then, do they just assume like, I I get that like they want to program it, the AI, so it's like well we can debuff her, so no matter what we're still gonna attack because it will do a negative status effect, which can then make our attacks do damage later. But if they like don't do damage, like they die, and then. You see it, it's like, all right, we're still not doing damage, and we know it can't stack. We're still going to do it. Like, Yeah, I don't know. That why. is the flaw. I, I don't know, but I will not look a gift horse in the mouth right now. That is for sure. Yeah, especially in one like this. Yeah, like, see, they hey, just, yeah, they, I th yeah, see, they still do zero damage to her. And yeah. even though that is pretty funny. I mean, this is easy. Wait, do we... they? What? Do they apply the debuff if they die? Um, yeah, because the shuriken still hits. But they're not around for the shuriken to activate. No, no, no. Or does it activate in combat? Yeah, 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 see, the shuriken activate. Oh, yeah. I see. And even though the debuff applies... They oh, this doesn't kill. Yeah, I know. Even, no, even though she's debuffed, they... She, I mean, because the steel shuriken debuffs your strength by three, though. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, okay. Mozu, please... <laughs> that watch. one's weird. Ow, also, the fact that God damn, she cannot what? hit shit. I missed an eighty nine. Are you serious? That's crazy. Oh my god, the running back. I know. Because no, the I fact know. that she has like weapon triangle disadvantage and they're still like and they're still only pulling thirty percent hit rates is kind of crazy. All right, I hope this guy this guy shouldn't proc miracle though because I'm deep. No, he, he, him he would HP. never. Yeah, since he's going to 1 HP, it shouldn't matter anyways, because that's actually, like, the best way to deal with Miracle. Just reduce the rest to 1 HP. Oh, yeah, because they can't block it at that point. All right. Yeah. All Just right. hit him with the Soth Bane and from Radiant Dawn. Simple. <laughs> yeah, it's literally Soth's Bane. Yeah. No, it's easy as that. Just do that. It's like, well, I didn't kill you, but you can't use Miracle now. All right. So, so basically, we did the same oh, wow. thing that would have happened. These guys really suck, actually. I mean, you're... That's Prime Camilla right there. Like, I don't know what you expected from that. I mean, she has 17 res, and these guys... I mean, only the Tiger Spirit can actually damage her. Yeah. That's a Rat Spirit right there. That's not exactly Hoshido's strongest soldier you're looking at. Alright, well, Effie just cleared out the entire room. Thank you. 
Uh, as she does, yeah. Right, she so does th tend to do that. All right. Well, Kaze doesn't have um doesn't have lunch, so I'll just have you. Uh, okay. Yeah, this is fine. Okay, I believe you. All right, and I think these guys will move next turn. Okay, he does six damage to you. That's fine. So we meet again, Lord Alex. After our last encounter, I did not think we would battle again. But as an enemy of Hoshido, it is my duty to take you down. I respect you too much to hold back. I shall do all I can to vanquish you. I understand, and I shall do the same. Let's do this. Dodge. Oh, come the fuck on. I would never. <laughs> oh, okay, they're moving. Okay, I didn't think they would move. Yeah, now they're moving. Well, they got, like, other people. I think that they'll uh, move yeah. back if... Well, yeah, I know. Like, they'll move back if there's, like, nobody in range, like, to move forward towards us. But then if there's nobody that their oh. AI will allow them to attack... Oh, no. You're kidding me. I can't kill him? I was gonna say, can we capture Azama before no, he's No, you can't capture, like, playable characters in, like, other Oh, world. that's right. I fucking forgot. How the fuck did I forget that, actually? Okay, well, um... Oh, my God. I wish I had... Dude! I wish I had... Niles, what the fuck? I wish I had the duel Yumi, because then I could, uh, have a weapon triangle advantage against these guys. Hey, what are you gonna do? Uh, do you still have the duel club? Do you have it on, Camilla? Yeah. I mean, oh, uh, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, see? Yeah, but the I know thing things. is, though, that if she gets hexed, then that's gonna kind of suck for me. Well, then let's kill the rest of them, too. Alright, I mean, the Tiger Spear is the only one that can damage her. Just, it's quite literally don't a shrimp or that. Oh, please don't proc Miracle. That's funny. Okay, thank you. What is there like? I gotta check this. I don't think it's high, uh, though. Not high. <laughs> um, <laughs> Say and, that. Okay, they have a 1 out of 10 chance of proccing Miracle. Yeah, it's certainly not low, but it's definitely not high. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna have to move Baruka and Elise back. Okay, Fair actually, enough. no, this is perfect. She, yeah, okay, there. I mean, what? Let's see, 15. Oh, wait, they actually don't do any that much damage to Elise. Okay, so if they go for her, I'm fine with that. <laughs> okay, um, Sil Okay, yeah, Silas can get this. Um. Okay, yeah, Subaki's Pike. He's gonna get doubled, unfortunately, but that's fine. I am Kaze, a ninja in the service of the Hoshino royal family. But enough pleasantries. To battle! I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot that I voiced him. So I was like, isn't that your line? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. It points like, trans oh, speed Oh, that's me! Oh, nice, nice, Silas. All right. I cannot not get these kind of fucking levels. Well, we're about to see if you can. God, I hope so. And nice, it's just enough damage with the brass knocking out. I need to get you nice. to D rank. Oh, uh, Lance oh, XP. Oh yeah, advantage. Lance XP. Such power and such determination. You're truly a worthy opponent. Perhaps the royal family was wrong about Norians. Uh, oh, oh, D rank, nice. You can now use. Hey, Giants. it's D rank. Finally. Nothing else matters now. Awesome. Thank God. Oh wait. Uh. Okay, yeah, I have Niles. Okay, I can't get that. Ch I can get the chest. Thank God. I was like, wait, how am I gonna get these chests though? Uh. Oh, nice. You missed. Okay, nice. You missed Camilla. Solid. That means I can actually... kill this motherfucker. That, that means I don't have to worry about. Okay, he does have counter though, so I do need to worry about that. Yeah, that is true. As long as I attack from range, I'm fine. There you go. And oh my god, Jesus! Kill him. Burn that gaggle, fuck! Burn him. All right, Nick's gonna get this kill because she can just quad him. Nice. Why must you resort to violence? I really do despise savages. Alright, well, I just advise you and your in your miracle, dude. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god, well, good thing, just hit him again. Oh! Hit him, hit him. <laughs> hit him. Thank god for I would have been pissed. You have much strength. I love to do so, but I must retreat. Oh my I god. I would have been pissed. I missed the 95. That what is this shit? What the fuck? And what the hell? Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, I'm just Uh, gonna... well, she does have weapon triangle disadvantage, so that is fair. 
All right, well, I'll just move her to the next to Elise because she'll uh, give her minus three damage. That is good. And she can still attack. Yay. Nice. Ow, okay. Hmm. All right, just mend her up. And let's see how she does now. There we go. It's good. And if she misses, Camilla should finish him off. And if not, True. then we're kind of fucked. It's all right, we're good. All right, Baruka, first level up. Let's see, level 10, jeez. Skill and defense. Mmm. A lunge, at least. All right. Okay, so let's... All right, so this next room... Oh my god, this room is, like, such... It's so rude. Espe I hate these guys, especially. What, the life and death bitches? Yeah. Because they have such weak weapons, but you, but that 20 damage is lying right there. They're essentially going to do 30 damage. So does life and death calculate for them, like, after the fact? Like, you mean, is it actually calculate like, here saying that they have 20 attack? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, it actually, they have 20 attack, but they have to take life and death into account, so they technically have 30. So pretty much it doesn't show it visibly on the yeah, it, yeah, it's, stats. It's not, yeah, it's, yeah, the stats are technically lying to you right here. That's so fucking mean. I know. And what sucks is that they have these, like, they have these ninjas with steel katanas with lunge. So they're going to lunge you off the staircase so you can't retreat. Damn. Oh I my mean, god. Yeah. I mean, it's rude, but it's really cool though. Like, that's smart. It's like, you can't retreat. That is true. Because <laughs> something that you might be, like, planning on doing, like, might have done the previous floors you can't do here. And it's like, oh, wow. Well. Yeah, because technically, because you saw with um, uh, with Epi, we just like we just like slowly pulled the archers here along with the ninjas here. Yeah. Now yeah. here, now what so sucks is that they're gonna lunge you off the staircase, and then you're either gonna get hit with a ninja, which does have poison strike now, or a mage with malefic aura, which. Um, oh boy. My favorites. So how do I do against um these um samurais? If you can kill them in one hit, it doesn't really matter though. True. Alright, so I can kill the... Okay, so, um, I can kill this guy with the raider, with the raider knife, so... Yeah. I'm, I'm just gonna wait until next turn, just so that way everyone's ready. Fair enough. And how do I do against this mage? I do kill the mage! Okay, so if, if Mozu can just not die to the mage and kill the samurai, I should be fine. Sounds good. Alright, I just need to make sure I have the Raider Knife equipped. And hope sure she doesn't die. Sure we should. Alright, let's see what's in this chest. Uh, and Feeble. Ooh, nice. That's my score. Ooh, that's nice. Actually, I think I'm going to keep that. And I think, um... I think I can reach one of them from here. No, I can't. Okay. Oh, really? No. Never mind. Well, it's nice to have anyways. Yeah. And let's see, so this ninja can reach. Wait, can he reach? Uh, yeah, he can. Okay. Uh, I don't know how good FP. You know what? Guard Nina. If they kill her with the Guard Nina, fuck this game. I'm just stopping this LP right here. That's a lot of shit you're putting in here. Alright, well, let's see how we do. <laughs> you're saying a lot with that. Just keep that in mind. Right, poison Especially strike. because we're getting Poison Strike today. Okay, nice. They're gonna lunge her, well, unfortunately. That's yeah, they will. Uh, she can be in range of the mage. Uh, no, she's out of the range of the mage. I'm pretty sure. What? Yep, yep, I marked. Yep, I marked. Wait, what? All oh, right, armored oh. blow. Armored blow. Fuck. Oh yeah. Huh. Oh no, that's not good. It's fun. Oh, okay. Not, oh, okay. This is actually perfect. Oh yeah, life range and, sword. Yeah, and this is why life and death is a scary skill. <laughs> Yeah, that's 14 damage right to your face. Unless you shield gauge it, in which case, go fuck yourself. Oh no, okay, I gotta kill that mage now. Yeah, I kinda do. Thankfully, you have the tools to do it. Yep. And I'm gonna nobody else can really touch Mozu too much. Definitely nobody can fucking touch, uh... Effie. <laughs> Alright, nice. Level up for Mozu. Level 15. Level 15? Strength, <coughs> speed, and res. Nice. Everything you need. Nice. And what? Uh, oh wow! With the okay, they only do three damage there with the bold like another. Life and death, though. I'm not. I'm not gonna use that. 
um, until I can guarantee that that life and death guy is off the table. Fair. No matter what, that is always a bit of a scary skill. Alright, so they should move off the staircases next turn. Okay, wow, they go for Mozu. Okay. Alright. Alright, block. And luckily, I get rid of their shield gauge. Die. Alright, uh. Okay, they still launch me. Alright. Ugh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Ow! Oh, God. Thankfully, it's still a kill. Yeah, and I but have still, a shield gauge. Ooh, myself, God. But still, oh, God. Yeah, yeah, it's scary though. That's the thing. Cause like, if it does hit, Absolutely. you're gonna you're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you are. All right, I think now we can actually move you guys in, cause there's no life and death guys. And oh yeah, nice. Since I you have D rank now, I can get you. Um, let's see what the broom. <laughs> I get a lance. Seriously, only the okay. No, the beast killer is D rank. All right. Oh boy, can't wait to fight all the beasts. Uh, are we facing? No. God damn it! Like, not, not in this chapter. I'm wait. I don't wait. I think the beast cover might be effective against Pegasus knights. Oh my god! Are you fucking kidding me? You've got to be shitting me. Seriously, this is getting hard to like see. It's getting hard to happen to, cause it's happening to me. Yeah, you're the protagonist, and we need you to be good. No, my bad, King. Alright, so I wonder who- this guy might go for either you or Sal- uh... I think he'll go for you, possibly. Yeah, fair enough. Um... Uh, oh, thank god. Yeah, let's not do that yet. Yeah, right, so I'd rather not! For, for, I'd okay, rather no, no, not he, send he, Elise directly into the- Oh, um... okay, he goes for Silas. Oh, hey, missed. Fuck that guy. Nice. And we only have one room left after this, right? Yeah, and it's, it, this is like the easiest yeah. room of all. It is. No, we're like only 30 minutes in. This is a fast chapter. Yeah. Because there's not like a lot of empty space and like fill where you got to traverse, you know? It's like just from one room to another, mm -hmm. which I appreciate because it makes the chapter feel a lot faster. And I enjoy like the bigger maps. They're like more grand and shit. Oh yeah, I love. But the, they, um... they got a lot of empty space sometimes. They yeah. really do. Oh, spirit dust, nice. I wish that was an energy drop, but I'll take it. I wish it was an energy drop. So I was about to say that. I'm like, damn. Why did we use the fucking energy drop on Mozu? I mean, good, but why did we use the energy drop on? If Mozu? I knew that your strength was gonna it. be this much of a pro, I would have given that one to you actually. If I knew my strength was gonna be this much of a problem, I would have agreed with you. I thought a sixty percent would have been fucking fine, but I guess not. Because how many levels has it been? Like seven? Uh, yeah. When's the last time six. I've gotten strength? What am I at? Like eleven right now? I uh, without the mail, yeah. What the fuck? What was my what was my base? Like ten? I think so. I mean, I gotta see this. I'm gonna pull up your stats because I did. Take I a gotta see this shot. too. There's no fucking way. That I only got one point of strength, like what, 13 levels? As 60% growth? Like, actually, what is the mathematical <laughs> chance of that? That I can't figure out. I'll fucking, I'll do some math right fucking now. Um, let me, if I only got one point of strength, then let me calculate that, because that's a 40% chance times 13. Let me see. Uh, okay, so you started out with, I'm gonna pull this up right now. How do you fucking calculate probability against some of a bitch? Okay, you, fucking... ha you started out with was nine other... base strength, actually. Oh, nine. Okay, so it's two. So I've gotten two points in 13 levels. Great. No, no, remember, you That's... started out at level, um, uh, you started out at level, um, uh, eight, actually. Level eight cavalier? Level eight nor prince? Level eight nor prince. Do I go back to level one as a cavalier? No, you no. At level ten, okay. I, oh. I I Oh, that's only you. six levels. Oh, that's so much better. That's only a third of my levels that I haven't gotten that I had gotten strength, and then two thirds I hadn't. Okay, so it's that's not doable. that bad, but still, it's it's still it's not bad. that great. Yeah, it's not that bad, a, but it's not that good. It's a six out of ten chance that I get it. 
and four out of six times, I haven't gotten it. So what does that say? Not, it's not good, I, I can say that much. Fucking no. Okay, so I don't want to kill Hinoka yet, because if I do, that ends the chapter. Yeah, it does. I do want to get as much experience as I can, so... Let's see. Yeah. Um... Where is... Okay, there's Silas. And how do I do... Okay, you don't do... Okay, you don't take that much damage from her. Oh my god. Oh, shit. Okay, that's not good, actually. Yeah? Okay. Is she, yeah, I guess she's the older sister for a reason, son of a bitch. Okay, we got this. I think yeah, I might sure. just... I think I might just end the chapter, though. Yeah? Don't want to get any more XP? Just uh, fucking finish means, it? Not if it means kill, getting you killed. I wouldn't die, surely. There's no way. Possible. Um, would the Beast Killer work on these guys? Like, oh, do yeah, they count as... Do that. they... I, I was gonna say, do they only count as flyers, or do they also count as, like, mounted units? I think units? it only counts as flyers, but it doesn't matter, though, because they have, um, uh... They have wing shield, so I don't No, protects from bonus damage against flyers. Oh yeah, how does mode do you do? Okay, she actually takes no damage from these guys, so what I'm gonna like, do is I'm actually gonna see if the Hunter's Knife um, is effective. Son of uh, a bitch. Oh my god, it is! Oh, it is! Are you serious? Holy shit! Let's I, go! <laughs> I didn't think it would be effective. I'm a genius! <laughs> I didn't think, because it doesn't show, like, because they, they are flyers, but I guess you consider the Pegasus Knights as flying horses, I guess? See, that's the thing, is that I know some games consider them as both, like, horse units and flyers. Like, I think Awakening did that too, but I don't remember. Um, whereas, like, the, that's, like, kind of how they differentiate between, like, the Pegasus Knights and the Wyvern Knights, where it's, like, their only weakness was bows in that case, whereas the Pegasus Knights was bows, but also, like, beast killer weapons. Mm -hmm. I didn't think they would so. be effective, though. Alright, that's nice I'm to know. I'm glad it actually. is! <laughs> that shit is great! Ooh, Pike Rune Club, too. Oh, mm -hmm. say less. Oh, that's fucking funny. Ah, uh, does the Dual Club do it against the... the Samurais, actually? Uh, no. It leaves them down at 1 HP. What if you had F... uh, not Fe, at least nearby? Uh, yes. But the thing is, though, that I can't. There's no way that she's gonna live. A, that Seal Nagiri is actually physical based, and she's not gonna. I was gonna that. say, isn't it she like gets, she gets is doubled? Is least as passive of uh, three spaces, or? Hey, no, it's just adjacent. Oh, it's adjacent, dude. I fucking forgot. I'm thinking of Demoiselle then, probably. Uh, yeah, Demoiselle. Yeah, but it just. That's. Yeah. Oh, that's two spaces. Oh shit. Mm -hmm. I'm very stupid. I must be thinking of the Awakening one then. God damn it. All right. Well. Oh wait I'm... a minute. Also, I can get the hunter's like lance. I think. Oh yeah, the beast killer. Rank. Beast killer. That's it. How does yeah. that do? Oh. oh. <laughs> Let's go for it. Yo, worm. Let's go. Alex, we meet at last. Anoka. So you're the one who took the rainbow sage. You really are fighting for Nora. Eh? I had to see it with my own eyes. You saw him like literally leave. You were you. there. Yeah. I, he had to fight before. Like. Yeah. This is our second. Oh my god. You know, I spent so many years wishing I could be near you. Now you're right here in front of me, but we couldn't be further apart. Sorry it had to be this way. I mean, that is kind of poetic, the way she said that. No, it is. I really like that. Mm -hmm. I know you want me to return to Hoshido and for us to be a family. It kills me to have caused you so much pain. It is a burden I shall always bear. However, I... I... I know, you need to say another word. I also know you won't back down. I can read your sad eyes like an open book. After all, though we hardly know each other, but you're still my little brother. Hinoko. If you're that determined to fight, then so be it. Let's see if all that resolve is enough to take down your own sister. You're not actually his sister. Ah, uh, he doesn't know that. He's stupid. Thank you, Silas. Let's go. Silas the goat. Love him. Forgive me, Hoshido. I just wasn't strong enough. And... Do I get oh, all nice. this? No. Like 50 XP. Still good, though. Silas and I have the tick, bro. I am nice. surprised. Cool. Yeah. No, they, they did really good. But we won. It's over, Hoshidens. Retreat while you still can. I'd hate to destroy such brave soldiers, but I will if I must. Uh, we're, we're out of options here. Everyone, retreat now. Leave the dead behind, at least for now. There's no time to lose. 
Ugh. Oh. That won't be necessary. We suffer no casualties, not one. Many of our soldiers are injured, but they'll recover and they can all still walk. What? How is that possible? I don't understand. Uh, Alex, what is the meaning of this? Uh, uh, What's this you're doing? Run, Hinoka. Why are you hesitating? Go! Get the fuck out! Fine, I'll retreat for now. But before No one that, remembers you anyways! Before that devil, you call his sister Stasis in the back. Yeah, like, after, like, like Takami and Ryoma joins her in birthday, she has, like, no lines. Even in Revelations, it's less. No, in Revelations, it's actually fucking crazy when they were all, like, saying goodbye to Makoto, and it's like, Oh yeah, Ryoma, Takami, Sakura. You know, that's, like, one line, you. and that's it. <laughs> yeah. Goodbye, my brother. And, uh... Oh, my little Alex, you really are too kind for your own good. Ha! Ah! Telling us all not to kill any oceans before we even enter the building. You certainly made things difficult to us, but it was a fun challenge, at least. That's what Lunatic is for. We certainly shouldn't chase after them. It's not too late to kill them all. No, Camilla, let them go. Blazing a new path for Nora, one of mercy. <laughs> There'll be no more pointless killing. That's the only way to end this war. Okay, now we've received, received the notion suggests all that's left is to find the Rainbow Sage. I hope you fucking felt the air just rushing out of my body with the... Oh, God damn it, Kaze. Is it true, Alex? Do you really mean to bring peace to this world? Kaze? What are you doing here? You dumb fuck! <laughs> Why don't you retreat from Hyok and the others? I asked my question first. Nuh uh. <laughs> you said your path is one of peace and that you seek to end the war. Is that true? If so, why did you choose to return to Noah? Yes, I spoke the truth. At first, I returned because I couldn't bring myself to betray my Norian siblings. But I soon realized that being a Norian prince granted me certain opportunities. As a Norian, I can change things from the inside, stop the death and destruction. Without me, the Norian army would keep slaughtering the Hoshidan army. And the Hoshidans would keep retaliating, a never-ending cycle of hate and death. Since I choose, chose to side with Noah, it's my responsibility to end that cycle. So, you know what's crazy is that if you sided with Hoshido, the place where your birth family isn't trying to fucking kill you all the time, and like you don't have to deal with political intrigue, you just say, hey, I want to stop the war, but like we win. And we just like, if you did the same non aggression bullshit and like didn't kill anybody with Hoshido against Nor, you'd be fucking fine. Yeah. You, you really would be. Because also, nobody else fucking likes Garen. So if you said to, like, a generic-ass soldier, Hey, come to Hoshido. Like, we're not gonna... Like, I'm not killing you. Like, we're trying to stop this war, but I'm not gonna kill you. It's like, let's just fuck Garen. And it's like... That's... Man, fucking... I'm sorry, Kaze, but if your intention is to take me to Hoshido, you're out of luck. I won't let anything come between me and my goal of bringing peace to this world. Oh, God. We did it, Patrick! We saved Bikini Bottom! <laughs> I see. I only have to look in your eyes to witness how determined you are. Yours is an admirable goal, my lord. As such, I request permission to join your ranks. Huh? Uh? Please forgive me for my past brashness. I should not have judged so quickly. When you left Hoshido, I thought you had betrayed us. Like the others, I was certain you meant to destroy Hoshido. I see now that I was horribly mistaken. <laughs> Your reasons for siding with Nora aren't just sound, they're actually quite pure. Uh... Pure? <laughs> sure, Jan. You've inspired me to hope for a piece I had long ago dismissed. I'm trying to keep it serious, I'm keeping it professional, man, as long as I can. Please allow me to lend my strength to your noble cause. Thank you for your kind words, Kaze. I'd be happy to have you, but... You know the others would call you a traitor, right? Can you live with that? Words cannot harm me, so long as I act of honor. I do not regret my decision. <laughs> You're gonna be in a world of fucking hurts. Oh yeah, just wait until next chapter. <laughs> oh yeah. That's all I needed to hear. From now on, you're one of us. Welcome to the team, Kaze. Why are we being called a team? Like, can't you just say army? I don't fucking know. Thank you, Lodox. I shall serve you to the best of my ability. I don't doubt it. Now to find the Rainbow Sage, you should be somewhere in this building. Of course. Allow me to show you the way to his quarters. Hmm. hmm. Um. 
Pardon me, but are you the Rainbow Sage? I am the one you seek. You fought a trying battle to get here, young warrior with a heavy heart. I did. I heard you have the power to make me stronger than I am. Please, a oh wise sage, would you consider blessing me of your strength? Ho ho ho! Oh, you're a funny little dragon, aren't you? You have already gone through my trial, which was experience, and so you have already received my power. Does which your... is more experience, but no strength. <laughs> Does not... Lighter, not stronger. Does your body not feel lighter than when you arrived here, and not any stronger yeah. than when you left? <laughs> I was so distracted, I hadn't really. But you're right. I suppose it does. It's like I have ten more speed. All who seek to find me must struggle through various trials to do so. Therefore, that's why you won't receive any strength. <laughs> it is amid that struggle that I witness and unlock their true power and potential. You it's... did. It's like steroids. You might get it for a little bit, but it all goes away eventually. That's what the stat boosters and meals are for. Thank you so much. I can't wait to show Xander my new power. You mean Xander your new speed? There is one matter we must discuss, brave Alex. You have in your possession the legendary Yato Blade, do you not? How do you know that? Wait, how do you know my name? Oh, ho, ho, so humorous. I know all there is to know. I know all that you have done and all that you are still to do. Hopefully that involves getting strength. But I won't spoil <laughs> the ending. That's for you to discover. I love Fuck how he her. says that. Like, imagine you just die, die in the end. Like, I won't spoil that for you. It's like, and then you died. The end. So anyways, how did you like it? Leave us a review on Yelp. One through five stars, please. Yeah. How are yeah. the fates from... Don't you know that Hoshido runs on Yelp reviews? <laughs> Yeah, and Nor runs on Tumblr. Dude, you gotta tip the Rainbow Sage, man. He runs. He lives off of tips. He's worse than the fucking servers. <laughs> However, the fates will allow me to divulge one little tidbit to set you on your path. As wielder of the Divine Blade, it is you who will solve the mystery of the Seal of Flames. The Seal is the key to bringing an end to the hatred and war that soil these lands. Solve the mystery and you will bring peace to this world at long last, so it shall pass. The Seal of Flames? Where do I start? I have two words for you. Twenty dollars. <laughs> Yato is the key. That is your first clue. Unfortunately, it's the annoying hero who would aid you is not present. That will change. Oh, uh, actually, the not they're a dark knight. Yeah, that too will not. That will change in the not too soon distant future. When the time comes, this will help you lead the way. Lift up your blade, Alex, if you can. As, as you wish, it. God, it's fucking heavy. <laughs> Shit, I, I thought that was the weapon weighed. <laughs> I who forged the sacred blade, I who committed the great sin, I who wove the divine powers, I call on you now, Seal of Flames. Ooh. Wing, 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 wing. And. Sweet. What just happened? Nothing yet. Nothing. I nearly <laughs> awakened a seed that was already sown. When you enlist the help of another hero of Nor, your blade will evolve. A blade fierce enough to guide us through the night. The Grim Yato. The Grim Yato? So if I unlocked it, will I be able to find the seal? No! The Grim Yato is a part of the seal of things, though it is not its final form. Perhaps one day you will meet your fate, head on, and unlock the seal's power. Perhaps. Perhaps, all I can but say. not now, and not in this path. <laughs> that is all I can say. Your past is an arduous one, but I believe in you. You'd better get going out here if the king is awaiting your return. Yes, King Garen, that prick. He still owes me twenty dollars for what? Man, <laughs> I'm skipping that scene. I don't care. What I the hate fuck? That fucking what scene, scene was it? I don't remember. The this Iago just like teleports like an image of him and tells you. To oh, kill what the, the fuck? Stage. We can't have Iago coming in and I get the fucking like. Actually, you voice Iago, don't you? Yeah, I'm not. No, I'm skipping that scene. I fucking hate it. Oh, what the fuck? He's funny. He is, but I hate. Iago's this just scene. that one rejected theater kid that never got into anything good. Like he. <laughs> Never got a lead role in any musical. He was tree number three one time in middle school. And, like, that's the best thing he ever got. I'm sorry, I hate it. I really do. I think it's so fucking funny. I don't know. Alright, so we have... This is the pot chapter it's... where we have to smash, like, a bunch of pots, which... Oh, God. Oh, boy. At least we're not shoveling snow. Oh, yeah. Not yet. I mean, me and Chris aren't oh, doing that yet. 
What's up? Me and Chris aren't doing that yet. That's true. Oh wait, is that in Birthright? I thought that was in Conquest. Am I fucking wrong? Uh, no, that's in Revelations. Oh, that's right! Like I said, Dude, we're not yet. I forgot about that shit entirely. <laughs> I really did. Alright, little eat your bottle of milk. There we go. Mmm, yes. Mmm, <laughs> this glass tastes funny. <laughs> is that blood? <laughs> The glass shards. <laughs> oh my god! I, I cannot believe. Like seriously, you're eating a fucking bottle of milk. How do you eat a bottle? <laughs> All right, let's give her some meats. I honestly wonder if this is like. I know we get like some money from this, like every three levels, but still, I just wonder if this is like. I feel like this is almost like a waste of time. Boy. <laughs> uh, okay. Nice. Thank you for the gold bar. It's, even after she dies, I'm still gonna do this just against a gold bar. Uh, Alright, yeah. so, um, we do have supports. Um, we, I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, what? Oh, okay, I thought Kaze had one with, uh... And I think we'll... Uh, do you want to talk about Kaze now, or do you want to do it when we get, um, Lazo and Perry? Well, let's talk about Kaze now. We might as well. All since right. the episode's already pretty short, like, we're not even that far in. Yeah, I guess we can extend it. But so uh, Kaze, um, he's a level 12 uh, ninja, soon to be level 13, and already I yep. think he's going to be a mainstay on this team. So Kaze's yeah, one he's of the, really good. Yeah, he's one of the few ninjas you can get. Like, you, there are other ways to get ninjas, but he's like the main, like, if you're going to use a ninja, he's like the one that starts out as one. And he yeah. is really fucking good, actually. Like, in, Bur in I think he's best in Conquest because he's the only ninja you get, like, like as like True. Be it, you know as like a ninja he his, he fits the niche a lot better and his growth rates are fucking busted with 85 percent speed 65 yeah. skill 40 50 percent res and 45 strength like 45 strength is decent yeah. 20 luck in 25 it's not bad is like you know, well he's he's like the speedy res ninja compared to saizo's like strong defensive ninja right yeah like yeah that's the thing yeah. i do prefer saizo though in my opinion. I do as well. But I think Kaze is really good on Conquest. Yeah, because he's like... Plus also green hair. I like green hair. Yeah, I mean, they're the... Like, the, like instead of Christmas Cavaliers, you get Christmas Ninjas, actually, in Birthright. <laughs> that is true, which I find really funny. Uh, hold on one second. Why... Okay, this was not supposed to change songs, actually. I said this to Luke. You don't want No Justice, Fire? Uh, actually, I'm gonna change... You want No Justice? I want, I'm gonna change the song, because I, uh... Change it... Dusk Falls? Ooh. Yeah. I do like Dusk Falls. Dusk Falls is really good. No, Duck Falls. I'm waiting for a, I'm waiting for a very momentous moment for, for where we play um a Dark Fall. That's like my favorite like um uh track. It's this. a really good one, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um Kaze We'll do I, it when I finally get strength again, that'll be great. Yeah, oh my god. That's when <laughs> I actually changed the song. But um yeah, yeah. Kazi's really good. Um like he is like he already comes with C rank and shurikens, and he's already level, yeah. about to be level thirteen, so and he already has eighteen base strength at level like twelve if you want to think you about it. You mean that. eighteen base speed? Yeah. Oh wait, eighteen base speed. Eighteen base strength is fucking crazy. I mean eleven strength, fifteen skill, fourteen res, like all of his growth rates are in the areas where he needs them. Like obviously his luck and defense are gonna be low, but that's to be expected of him. And he's gonna cap his speed. Like his speed at max is as a master ninja, which is what I plan on making him, is thirty eight. So he's gonna cap it. If he doesn't cap it, he, there's something he's wrong. He's very likely to cap that. He's yeah. only got twenty uh stats left to go on that, so if you level him up, like he's already level twelve, so you have like 28 levels to go if you promote him at level 20. Um, and that's quite a decent amount of time to get 20 points of speed. Yeah, plus he gets... Not even going into like everything else. Plus, plus gets, the extra plus 3. Yeah, and plus 5. So that's like 17 points of speed he needs to get in 28 levels. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. not bad. The only thing that hurts him is that he only comes with a seal shuriken, which does reduce his effective yeah. speed by 3. And True. it's the only shuriken that you can actually get if you don't count like these types of shurikens. But I am going to use him, though, because it, he's really good. He already comes with C-Rank and Shurikens, which Mozu is about to get C-Rank. But having C-Rank yeah. and Shurikens is good, because he can build the Saizo Star and the Kaze Nia, which are basically rallies in the forms of uh, yeah. Shurikens. No, they're pretty good. I like some of the hidden weapons. I think that the Kaze and Saizo uh, hidden weapons are pretty cool, just because of, like, hey, fucking rally weapons. Yeah. That's awesome. Like, speed and strength. I'm more so liking the Saizo Star, but mostly for you. <laughs> 
Yeah, thank you. <laughs> so I think I, that the Kaze one is pretty good for everybody else, though. Though so all all, we haven't been fo relying or needing like too much speed. We're doing no, pretty decent so far. No, not really. So all in all, I think Kaze is a fantastic unit in in conquest. Like in birthright, he loses a little bit of his luster because you get so many ninjas in in um uh, really in birthright. And you get same, like what three? Uh, you get Kagero, you get um Saizo, and then there's Kaze. And Kaze, I know he's the first one to join you, and Kagero comes a little bit after, and Saizo's like one chapter after Kaze joins you. Yeah. So I do think Kaze is like really good in Revel in uh, conquest though. Birthright, he loses a little yeah. bit of his luster, and Revelations, it's kind of the same thing, but it's even worse. Than this. I don't know why, but he comes in with low base strength at that point. And yeah, I'm glad that, coming in earlier. I'm glad that he does auto level to this point, so I will rate him yeah. five stars. Like he's a really, really good unit for 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 conquest. Like he's one of the few units that you will actually see consistently double, and doubling in conquest is paramount. It is no small feat. Yeah, it really, is not. I would give Kaze four out of five stars because I don't think he's like the perfect unit. Like he's not like oh my god, like you have to use him or you're gimping yourself. Or it's like he's like an insta win button or just like a really good like i think he's really good oh, yeah, and no, really like versatile that. well yeah well i think that there are some units like camilla for instance where if you don't use her you're at a little bit of a disadvantage just because it's like how fucking good she is yeah um like that is a five out of five star unit like 100 yeah there's but constantly i think is like on yeah there kind of are but i think the kaze is like still really good his join time is pretty decent, and he fills a very specific niche, that being the ninja role, which, like, he's pretty much the only person that's going to do that at base. Yeah, um, like, Felicia can only do so much because she, because she, she's more so meant to be healing, and same thing with Jacob. Yeah, um, but no, I think Kaze's really fucking cool, um, and coming in with C-rank uh, hidden weapons is pretty nice, because if you're not spamming arm scrolls on people, you're probably not going to have a huge amount of people that are at C rank in any sort of weapon immediately, unless you're hardcore using them. <laughs> or again, like, spamming arm scrolls, because god knows you fucking need to sometimes. Um, but yeah, no, he's pretty good. His base stats are all around, like, really good. He's good in the areas he needs to be. His strength can be a little low sometimes, and sometimes, like, it can let you down. His personal skill is a little weird, being that, like, it, I don't know, is it's, it, like, a luck percent chance, or is it a guarantee? It's the, um, like, main unit of Luck set. Oh, it's it's luck percent chance. Oh, it's main units luck percent chance. Yeah. Oh hold yeah, on, target. Hold on one second. You good? Okay, everyone. Sorry, we're back. I had to take a phone call, but we're back. And uh, yeah, we were talking about Maraca's safe. So it basically, think of it like this. Let, let's say um like Baruka is the main unit, and like Kaze is like the supporting role. <coughs> this will only proc. <coughs> <laughs> if, um, Bless him. Thank you. Yeah, I think it's it's neat. Like it's a miracle without having to like really use a skill. But also like, damn, I just wish the bitch had a better personal skill. Yeah, like but lot, like personal skills I think are best in the face. But like, let's be fair. A lot a personal skill like trust me, they vary in terms of like of utility. And this one, yeah. in my opinion, is definitely in the lower tier of personal skills. I think so. I think it's like, it's got some use just once in a while, but it's really just that once in a while, like, oh, hey, that's neat. I'm glad that proc. That's, yeah, like, I wasn't expecting that. For, like, um, Elise, because she has 20 luck, but still. Yeah, but, like, the problem also is if that does proc, it's kind of a failure already. It's just like, damn, it's kind they of were like, going to fucking die. It reminds me of, it reminds me of, um, so it's guard skill, because, like, what... Cause think of it like it's like um Soth with um Makaya because Soth came with guard. It's like when the yeah. fuck are you ever gonna have Soth next to Makaya? <laughs> Hope that guards activate. It's like in but in this case, when the fuck are you ever gonna have Elise in combat with Kaze as a partner? Hope that miraculous sacrifice, miraculous save activates, and then like what the fuck? Like it's just not good. It's definitely in the lower tier personal skills when it comes to um Kaze. Yeah, no, it really is. Um, but I think that overall, like, he's pretty good. I would say he's probably one of the better units in Conquest. Um, so that is why I give him four out of five stars. And he also just, like, he's on a good class. And it's not a class that's easily accessible in Conquest, so I think that that's part of his value. Yeah. His joint time is good. His base stats are good. His growths are good. Strength can be an issue sometimes, but even then he's a ninja. He's got Poison Strike, and he's got debuffs yeah. and buffs for his team. So, pretty good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's really it. 
So I do think that um uh, like if you're going to use him, I definitely think like you can like even if you don't plan on using him, you you can use him as a fair unit for the for the um um like the rally shurikens as well as the debuffs and the poison strike. Like chip damage, I will not say no to. Hmm. I gotcha. So, um, yeah, we do have support, so I guess we can just get these out of the way. So, I guess, uh, you and, uh, Kaze first. Huh. <sighs> something wrong, Kaze? No. What's with all those radishes? Ah, Lord Alex, greetings. A young lady gave me these radishes as thanks for helping her find her way. Looks like we're having a radish feast tonight. That's pretty great, right? I must disagree. It is not great. No? What's the matter? Do you have something against radishes? It feels wrong being rewarded for such a simple kindness as giving directions. This is not the first time something like this has happened either. It's not? I can't figure out why, but I find I'm often approached by women who wish to speak with me or give me things. Oh, is that so? It gets worse. If I speak even a few words, they'll often start shrieking or hugging me. Sometimes they'll give me letters or garments of clothing or, like today, food. None of our allies act that way, of course, just strangers. It's frustrating. <laughs> Sounds to me like you're just popular with the ladies. Popular with the ladies? He's so dumb, I love him. <laughs> exactly. These women are just, well, they're curious about you. It's because you're kind, yet mysterious. Being a ninja doesn't hurt either. In fact, when I was in town the other day, I overheard one of the local women. She said, that sorrowful look on Kaze's gorgeous face is way too dreamy. <laughs> oh god. Ah, oh, I wish you hadn't told me that. I appreciate the praise, but I prefer to focus on my duties and keep such silly distractions to a minimum. Uh, one sec. Did I set this to... Okay, I did set it to loop. No, you set it to loop. You're Alright. <laughs> You're so serious all the time. Most men dream of this kind of attention. I'm simply behaving as any self-respecting ninja should. It's all there is to it. Cook your shit! <laughs> Cook your shit, king! In any case, they are mistaken. I am not a good man. Why would you say that? It's nothing. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an urgent matter to attend to. God, just like that. You're so cool. I wonder what he meant by that. Why does he think he's not a good man? Alright, this is the rank and chief. Find out in the later supports. Ooh, oh, wait. Bitch. Oh, please tell me I can get something in for the lottery shop. Don't give me a bronze weapon, Maybe. please. Okay, well. Ain't a bronze weapon. Alright, wheat. Alright, oh wait, cool. who's, who's on cooking doing? Please tell me it's not Oh sure. boy. Oh boy. Fuck! God, twice? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Hang on, wait one second. Let me try doing this. Maybe this'll, like... Okay, so... Maybe this'll change the cook? I doubt it. Oh no, it does. Okay, just change the food. I'll take a generic, though, for Felicia. Okay. Alright, defense... Uh, no, not you. Okay. Uh, let's try strength, and hopefully you're in this one. Uh? Please. Uh, no. Alright, let's try again. Uh, yeah, okay, yep, you're in this one. There we go, okay. Hey. I just didn't want Felicia, because you know that she's going to cook you something fucking awful. Uh... All right, so let's set the hero back. There we go. All right, so uh, let's get. Um, I don't think we need anything, honestly. Uh, I think we're more or less fine. Um, I mean, there is no Sparado. Do we already have one? Oh, let me get another javelin for you, actually, because since uh, hell yeah. Um, no Sparado. We have one, but Nyx is like the only one that can use it right now. Oh, yeah, that is true. Yeah. Once can we, we get, forge that? Uh, you can, but I don't want to force an Osferatu because I'm going to, um, give one to, um, uh, to, um, Le um, I'm going to give the other one to, um, Leo when he joins, 
and okay. I'm going to reclass him to a um, um to dark a, mage. Yeah, dark sorcerer to, to a sorcerer when he joins. I see you. All right, and let's get into the next chapter. Um, let me just give you that javelin and. Where is and there we go. All right, let's get out of here. Let me just make a cut. Uh, before we start the next episode, I got to go. Massive shit. <laughs> okay.